Hi, this is Daylene Barton with naturalfertilityinfo.com and we are now carrying pregnancy tests. These are the same kind of tests that your doctor or um, you know the hospital or anyone else is going to use in vitro. So they're pretty self-explanatory. Um, they actually have a nice little chart on the back that shows you um, the test results which you're going to want to check out. So we are now carrying these in our natural fertility shop and we sell them in, you know, 10 packs up to 50 packs. So we wanted to provide that service for you so that you can purchase all of your items together so you don't have to go, you know, to a drugstore or whatever or a different website and have to purchase these pregnancy tests that you can just um, purchase them here. So this is going to be a lot like the OPK test or you know and remember like I said I don't know if you watched the OPK test video but these look very similar they're actually um, both have a blue and a kind of a foil um, packaging and they look very similar the OPK test has a green strip um, the pregnancy test has a blue end so um, make sure that you're not accidentally using the wrong one. Make sure that you're reading the label. And you're just going to dip it into where it says the max line is for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. And then you're going to set it um, on a non-absorbent surface such as you could just set it across the um, cup that you used, you're going to want your urine and your test strip to be at room temperature, so make sure that you store those properly. Uh, okay, so you're going to want to check your test within five minutes of performing the test. So after five minutes, um, you're not going to want to read the results. So because we used water, of course, the result is going to be negative, but um, in this test, you can see, I'm going to just walk over here real quick show you that you can see the line right there and it is um, positive that it worked. It's not positive because there's not a second line but the control line is there. So that's a good sign that the test worked. Um, you're going to want to begin testing if you think you may be pregnant or if you've been trying to conceive one day after your missed period. So your HCG hormone is not going to show up as much or may not even be present in your urine yet for testing before that. So it's really best to wait. I know that we get impatient, but um, it can be really disappointing when you take that test and you see that it's negative, but it might just be too early. So if it's already been one day since your missed period and you took the test and it was negative, wait 48 hours and test again. Um, and then test again 48 hours after that and you can see that your HCG hormone should be um, raising. Now if you drink a lot of fluids there is a possibility especially in really really early pregnancy that you could dilute it um, and the test may not w show a positive. So if you think you're pregnant just wait 48 hours and test so again. So when you're going to read your test results it's pretty um, easy here. Um, you have your control line and your test line. Up a positive result is going to be two strong lines. Now your test line may look a little bit lighter, but if it shows up at all, you're more than likely pregnant because it's going to pick up the HCG hormone. Um, different stages of pregnancy, you have, you know, at the beginning stages, you have less um, of this hormone, especially at the beginning, so it might not show up as strong. Whereas if you tested, say, a month into your pregnancy, it could show up pretty bright. Um, if there's nothing, then it's negative. Um, if there's no control line, there that means the test didn't work. It was um, a bunk test. It needs, it's an invalid. So you need to throw that test away and retest. We're really happy to be able to provide you with these pregnancy tests and with the OPK tests. And we hope that you enjoy this pregnancy journey. And if you have any questions, please write us or um, contact us and we will get those answered for you. Have a wonderful day.